It reminded me of something. It's not the first time you've been injured outside of the ring. Do you mind telling us what happened? No, not at all. There? What happened was we were in Vegas. I go to Mike Goldberg's room, Frank Triggs in there. We're all buddies. And um, we go to the elevator on the 10th floor of the Hard Rock Hotel and the doors open and there's Dana. So the doors are open. We walk in, doors haven't even closed yet. Frank's asking Dana, who recently had exited from the UFC, they let him go. And he's basically saying like, you know, when are you gonna put me back in the octagon? They basically gonna ask him for a job, as Frank said in his interview. Dana had a special watch on. I really love the watch band and I leaned over and I looked, Dana, what a watch. And when I leaned over, Frank being over here, Dana against the wall, doors have not even closed yet. I get a rich hand to my throat from behind and it's like, what? Right? And I turn around and Frank hit me from behind. He cheap shot me. And I said to Frank, I said, Frank, you hit me. Why the F did you hit me? And he said the wrong thing. He said, what are you going to do about it? And my streak kicked in and I just went pop, pop. You know, it's like, hey, nobody puts their hands on me. I don't care who you are. Doors close and Dana's up peeled against the wall and Frank and I are going at it and we're going at each other. And then the doors open and I put my hands in the air. I said, Frank, we're done, we're done, we're done. The reason for that was because in the hard rock, in those days, they have all these glass encasements. We would have spilled out the elevator and probably gone through the glass. So I stopped, my sixth sense kicked in, I stopped, and I had blood up and down my shirt, my thumb is peeled back, I can see the bone. I mean, you know, crap happens when you're banging back and forth. And obviously I cut my finger on his belt buckle or one of the rings or whatever. And, um, you know, we all, I'm laughing, he's laughing, Dana's laughing, and uh, but then they see the blood on my finger and Frank's like, oh no, no, no. And, I said, guys, I'm good. I went to the paramedics. I go, can you glue it shut? They go, no, you got to go get stitches. So I go to the uh, triage, the emergency hospital in Vegas. $500, tetanus shot, um, six stitches, I think. And uh, then I went out and had a good time. And yeah, hey, it was a great night. I mean, I, I felt like I was 18. I announced the UFC at, uh, in MMA and went out and did some dancing and, you know, party with some girls. And it's like, hey, I'll do that tomorrow night.